Hi guys, welcome to my match preview um, for the big Spurs game tonight. Tottenham Hotspur v Brighton, um, obviously in our new stadium. Um, this is such a good opportunity to get three points when all the teams around us, including ourselves, um, did drop points for the likes of Man United losing 4-0, um, Arsenal losing, Chelsea clawing last night, so... Um, and obviously we lost to Man City on the weekend, so this is a good opportunity um, to make a bit of a gap um, between the likes of Chelsea and Arsenal and United, obviously. Um, and that all starts tonight against Brighton. Um, Team-wise, um, I mean, Potts changed up quite a lot against Man City um, on the weekend, and I don't think we played. I don't think we played badly. Um, only losing 1-0 to City, I think that's very respectable, um, but our midfield in that game was very, very weak. Um, we had loads of players out and still do, so um, hopefully we don't struggle tonight in the midfield. Um, but we're not playing a, a, a calibre team like Man City, who passed the ball very quickly, so hopefully tonight, fingers crossed, we get three points. Um, and tonight could be a much needed win. Um, I do think we will get top four. We do have um, touch wood winnable games, I think, now until the end of the season. Um, so, yeah, hopefully we, we just pick up points and hopefully you get top four. Um, the top four and the title race is looking so good, so good for the neutrals to watch. Um, so hopefully Spurs can just carry the top, um, the top four race on um, by winning tonight. Um, Arsenal go to Wolves tomorrow night. Um, so that's, that's a hard game for Arsenal. They really need to win that um, if they have any chance of getting in the top four. Obviously they can get Champions League football by um, through the Europa League. Um, but I, I don't want to see Arsenal or Chelsea win the Europa League. Um, even though I'm sure it would be an all-London Europa League final. Um, but yeah, um, in goal, um, so if we're talking about the starting eleven on Saturday, in goal was Paolo Casaniga. Um, there was um, a, little, a little knock to um, Hugo Lloris on the weekend, which is part of the reason why Casaniga played. And I would like to see Casaniga start tonight. Um, in between the sticks, not because of the injury or anything, I I just don't want Lloris to get more injured because um, I think we we will really need him for two games against Ajax in the semi final. Um, so yeah, I'd play Gazaniga in goal at the back. Um, uh, apart from Gazaniga, I'd play a, a full strength team. I might maybe put Foyth in there. Um, maybe put Foyth. Um, Foy, Toby, um, and Jan or Sanchez. Um, midfield, this is where I think we lack a bit. Um, especially defensive midfielders. Um, Sissoko is injured. He got injured against Man City in the Champions League quarter final. Um, um, Dai is injured as well. Um, well, Dai has just come back. Um, so, um, he, he might be a bit rusty after a little break um but yeah ma massive points um, massive three points needed brighton obviously need as many points as they can now as they've just dropped massively in the last few weeks um and now all of a a few weeks ago they were looking fine they were safe um, and all of a sudden they're fighting for the for relegation in the last few weeks of the season so um brighton i'm sure would take at least a point tonight um, yeah, um, nothing but a win. I, I only want three points tonight. These are the sort of games we should be winning um, this season. But yeah, what are your thoughts um, on all the games? Let me know down below. Um, make sure you stay tuned for um, for the match day vlog tonight. Um, Son, um, just before I end it, I think Son needs to have a good game today. I don't, oh, I don't think he had a great game um, the other day against City, so Son really needs to step up tonight um, and hopefully get 
but I'll maybe get on the um, score sheet, who knows, but yeah, um, yeah, as I said, let me know all this down below in the comment section, um, who do you think will get top four, really interesting now, the last few games of the season, and so yeah, let me know, um, yeah, I hope you enjoyed this video, if you did, please drop a like and subscribe, and I'll see you in my next video, come on you Spurs.